traffic seems to have eased off a little bit here at Charlottetown, not quite as busy, which is good for the first solo. I guess final instructions are now being passed over to Anthony from his instructor. Yes, here comes the instructor. He's getting out of the aircraft. There's Anthony now closing the door. And there is the instructor has now closed the door and Anthony is about to depart on his first solo. The instructor obviously went in to get a handheld communication radio so he can keep in touch with Anthony. And now Anthony is taxiing out for his very first solo flight here at Chandler in the late and quite warm afternoon. Good luck, Anthony. This is going to be a great experience for you. And there he is now, um, arriving at the holding area, and we'll hear his call to traffic. This is a great moment in his life. just announced his first solo, but a Tobago aircraft um, firing up behind us probably drowned that, but he's announced it is his first solo, warning other aircraft that uh, they'll then, as all the aircraft community, they'll stay clear of the pattern. And he's lining up on the runway now, he's turning, he's waiting, and here he goes, the engine is firing up, and he, here he goes, he's now departing on his first solo flight. Good luck, Anthony. Here he goes, Anthony's first solo flight, and a beautiful takeoff. And he's away, and we'll pick him up as he goes now. He'll fly crosswind, then back downwind, parallel with the runway, approximately a half a mile to our west, and then he'll turn across and finally land, and we'll pick him up on the landing. And here is Antti now on his downwind leg of his very first solo. All looks great from here. We'll hear him call his base leg very shortly. As he disappears temporarily behind the trees, he'll then announce his base leg. Chandler traffic check is 68 November, turning uh, base for 30 left. Chandler, student first solo. Chandler. And he announced to people on the ground it was his first solo. And we've picked him up, and there is indeed an aircraft holding Chandler, for him. Traffic check is 6 8 November, turning finals for 3 0 left. Chandler. And there thank is you. The, the aircraft that's holding has obviously wished him good luck because he said thank you. Not over yet. He's talking to the other aircraft. And here he comes. And here is his very first unassisted landing. Totally by himself. Looks good. Little bit of wind. And here he is, he's over the threshold. And perfect, perfect 
perfect landing. This is going to be. Beautiful landing, beautiful. That is the end of his first solo. And he's just gone over the radio. Wow, what a good. Here he comes now, taxiing back for his second solo flight. Certainly seems to be enjoying it very much indeed. You should just catch him. There he is in the cockpit. Difficult to follow. Here we are again. He is taxied back and he's now at the end of the runway preparing for his second takeoff. Let's await his traffic call. Channel traffic, Cherokee 68 November, departing 30 left, second student first solo, Chandler. And you heard him reporting he's going to be part, departing into the pattern for the second student first solo. And he's rolling out now onto the runway. Second solo. Now we pick him up on the downwind leg of his second solo. We should hear his call in a moment. Channel traffic, Cherokee 6 8 November, student first solo, runway 30 left on base, Chandler. And he's just turned to base, as you've heard. And there he is, coming in, and the wind is quite strong now. I can feel it blowing from behind me, also making a cooling effect. But here he is on his approach for the second landing. Looks good from here. Nice height. And here he is coming over the hedge. Beautiful landing a second time. Absolutely marvelous landing. Thank you, sir. And there was instructor congratulating him. Nice and now we have one more to do to complete the first three solos. And here comes Anthony again in preparation for his third and final takeoff here, which will be the end of his uh, lessons for today. And we can only say how fabulous the first two landings were. They were absolutely brilliant. And there he is waving to us, he's thoroughly enjoying himself, as indeed I did on my first solo. And he's approaching the uh, holding point for the runway once again. And we will hear his call prior to his departing. He's now holding. I haven't heard anything in the pattern. through the checklist. See him checking the controls. Now. Channel traffic, Cherokee 68 November, departing 30 left, student third, uh, student third solo, Chandler. And here is, there was his call, telling him it was his third student solo. And he's now heading out to line up on the runway. And he'll be doing a rolling takeoff. There 
that's the power. He's off very quickly indeed this time. Beautiful takeoff. As he climbs out from Chandler on his third first solo flight. And we've now picked him up on the downwind leg again. He's now not quite opposite the numbers when he'll start to reduce power. But he is uh, fairly well in establishing the downwind leg. And we wait for his call to cross to uh, finals, a crosswind base leg and finals. behind the palm trees. Chandler traffic, Cherokee 6 8 November, turning base, 3 0 left, Chandler. And we pick him up now on his finals as he approaches the runway. See the heat haze on this quite warm, still, and humid afternoon. And here he is. This is the third and final solo flight. You can see the flaps are down. Beautifully positioned. Wind is ease off just a trifle. And here he comes in. He's over the thresh threshold. Correcting for the wind. Beautifully done. That was a beautiful first solo. And here he is now taxiing in at the end of his first solo. Great performance all round. There's his instructor guiding him in. And he should be very proud of himself. Now he wants to shut down and get this. There we have the shutdown, and there's the instructor going to congratulate him. Shaking hands with him on a fabulous job. I think he had the brakes on, I think he was touching the brake pedal. I told you it was difficult, it's easy to get your toes over the brake. And he's just getting his gear together and shutting the aircraft down, completing the post engine shutdown checklist. And there's his instructor with a camera. You can see him doing the final preparations, getting his headset out. Still finishing off shutting down the radios and the other navigation equipment. And I think he's getting out. Here he comes. Fabulous! And there he is back, safely back. He 
he was saying he's really sweating and there's his instructor about to take a photograph of him right next door to the aeroplane. Isn't that just nice? And here's that. So ends a great step in his flying career.